Hey guys, yeah, welcome I'm back to my channel. If you're new and you're watching this for the first time, hit the like and the subscribe button. Get to know me so I can get to know you. Anyways, hi guys. I've been gone for not too long, but as you can see, if you if you watch my previous videos, you can see that, hey, Sasha, something is wrong with you. You look different. And yes, I got box braids because long story short, my hair and I needed a break from each other. So this is why these are here. And as you can see that the background looks familiar. It's those who are familiar with my channel. I am back here in New York and I'm excited but I'm kind of going through withdrawal from Atlanta because I just miss, I miss it. But anyways, it is cold, it is gloomy, it is fall weather. So it is, it is October and you know what that means? That means the festivities begin. October, Halloween, November, Thanksgiving, December, Christmas, January, New Year. Like, I feel like usually people would be like, oh no, I hate the colder weather and the colder months. I would say not for the beginning part of um, the colder, much cooler months because you have cold weather but you have all the cool holidays and all the cool festives so which makes it a little a little bit better so I'm excited extremely excited I'm a holiday person so I get a little like corny and a little a little crazy but it is Friday the 13th and I'm a little sketched out like mm, I'm about to head to work yes fast forward I'm not, today's not my day off, but I wanted to come in front of the camera and say hi to you guys and say, update you guys just a little bit, because I haven't spoken to the camera in a minute, so I'm on my way to work, I have a closing shift, so I'm not going to be able to hang out with you guys today, but I just wanted to chit chat for a little bit, update you guys, see what's new, but let me know if you guys are feeling the braids, feeling the box braids, and yes, I'm wearing color. Sasha is wearing color, but I don't like when people say, Sasha, you don't wear color. You're very neutral and very like, you know, dark and stuff. I'm like, I wear a lot of color. My rack doesn't say it right there, but we're not, we're not looking at the rack. Look at my paintings. They're colorful. My couch is colorful. I'm a colorful person so just because I choose to wear black and white and grays and creams and stuff like that does not mean my personality is not colorful like but whatever I like my dark colors but I'm going through a phase where I'm just like you know let me let my personality shine just a little bit and be bold like be bold more confident and play around with color as you guys can see from my last my last video my last vlog you should check it out but I was wearing a bold eye look and I don't really wear bold eye looks but this summer I was just determined to wear colorful eyeliner colorful eyeshadow just to get into the like the one color lid that was going on like the makeup trend and i was into it and i'm still into it so i'm thinking about trying to move for forward into the fall and the winter and get a little crazy with some color and especially do some color blocking and stuff like i love doing color blocking like i would definitely wear my orange eye look that i did with this blue but I can't because I'm going to work and my work attire and my work attire is not my work attire is I can't I can't really wear and look like that so dress code needs to be appropriate for my job but if I worked anywhere else and they allowed me to I would legit 
be a walking rainbow but yes so i'm probably gonna combine this with another another vi another day but yeah nothing special today but just saying hello to you guys and okay hey guys so it is technically a couple days later and yes i'm wearing the same sweater but don't judge me because i just bought this sweater so therefore it is clean and there's nothing wrong with wearing the sweater to somewhere else i wore it to work and now i can wear it out just i don't care whatever you're gonna see the sweater it was cute i got comments on the color so hey i'm gonna i'm gonna wear it like i never wore it the first time but anyway um it is whoops it is like what sunday so i'm gonna head out to brunch with my friend tiara and my sister sarah you will see them later but we're about to head out it's let's see it's about to be sarah we need to go she taking too long like this is what she does she loves to like get ready and be done but when it's like time to go two seconds before we have to leave the house she be like oh no i want to take photos like in the mirror but she takes thirty thousand photos just to choose one that she think is decent but still but still so it's about to be at 11 o'clock we're gonna stop um at Dunkin' Donuts because your girl is hungry. I came home. We're not going to discuss what time I got home yesterday because <sighs> Sarah's trying to kill me. I'm running on three hours of sleep. Can I be in it? <laughs> not yet. Mom. I'm kidding. Wow. So this is... Bitch. Wait, I keep looking at the... Anyways, so this is my makeup look and it's cons it consists of... Nothing. Something... I did a lot today. I did a so, lot. So, eyebrows, highlight, <laughs> a little bit of highlight. Um, mascara, highlight on cheeks. You can't, you can see a little glow. Um, Vaseline. Less Vaseline. And then blush, you can't really tell. Whoa. But you guys will see the OOTDs and the venue in a few seconds. So, a few seconds? A few seconds. A few minutes. A few seconds, because this video. So it's a few seconds, not even. Probably less than a second. No, it is a second. It's stupid. Okay. Woman by the pet. Niggas don't know where I can. Why I really, really. She'll explain it. <laughs> what? This is real life stuff. Continue. I'm eating. Come on, explain it to them. We're at the Gateway Center. Project for Empty Space Art Gallery. I'm not ratchet. I don't chew and talk. The sausage is rude. I'm not rude. I just want to get it cleared and get on my nerves. As soon as we walk in, so it seems like you guys are walking in with us and we're explaining everything. Because I'm new to this. She's not. She's just very hungry at the moment. And Sarah says hi. Say hi, girl. <laughs> she wanted to talk to you guys. But now she's at the shy. And we're eating. We're waiting for Diara to use the bathroom so we could head to the main rooms to check out the artwork. But <laughs> they've, they've given us like the map. floor plan, which is like a map and it's cute and it's huge. So there's going to be a lot of like artwork to look through and see and just. And absorb and find inspiration and stuff like that. So I was low key want to say something, but I was like, that should be on the vlog. I'm about to say it, it's okay. I'm gonna say it because you're gonna cut it out anyway. Say it. No, I'm not gonna say it, Sasha. Anyway, so are you excited? Sarah's excited. She was happy that we're we're gonna hang out today. She was like, oh, we're going to this art exhibit, and Actually, I'm so happy. I, just, I wanted to be seen that. No, she didn't. Because she's dressed up, guys. The OOTD. Stop it, stop it, my toes. She's dressed up, so she was excited. 
and I was excited. I look I had it planned. I look very like oily, but I don't know if it's like the highlight. I don't know if it's a highlight or the coconut oil, but I'm ovulating right now, so my thumb. <laughs> My inside, you just kind of messed up, man. <laughs> Fix yourself. That's my nose ping, Sarah. You had doodle -doo on your nose. You see? You see this? This is what I'm talking about. I like, say I pass the chicken. You what? Passing the chicken. You're passing the chicken egg? Passing a chicken egg. That means I'm ovulating. A chicken Scramble leg eggs. or a chicken egg? Chicken egg. She's passing, passing a chicken egg. She's passing scrambled eggs. Technically. I'm gonna tell your vlog. Turn it off. Why? Because that's disgusting. No, it isn't. It matter. I don't know. A chicken egg is too big for it to be passing through you. I said scrambled joke. egg. It's just a joke because it's an egg still. Yeah, but you couldn't turn like fish eggs or something. Why? No, let's make it. That's nasty. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it is nasty. Like. Passing a fish egg. Don't nothing on me smell like no damn fish. Don't ever. <laughs> right. Anyways, are we ready? Yes, we are ready. Pick up your drink. You just left it there? That's your drink. You're the owner. Wow. So we're gonna... Spice it. I'm gonna get a so I my... I... I... Social media um, girl that posts just so people you don't think she doesn't have a boring ass life. No, I don't. I don't post at all because I don't really care who sees my my stuff. If you want to know what I'm doing, you have to be my friend. And you have to hang out with me. Okay. Hey, see her. Are you okay? Do we have to turn the camera off? That's not funny. She literally put a drop of wine. She's trying to get drunk and like, I'm no. No, Sasha, I drink like a fish. This is not I don't get this the, that, oh, like, that saying. Me, I'm that sorry. Me? Yeah. It's special for the water. And they all they do is drink. They don't drink anything. You see, I'm not the only one who has little <laughs> like oh, I've been the only maybe more rather than assassin. I kill him, I kill him, I kill him with compassion. Try the one behind you with all the lips there. Yeah, that must work. Um, she has six, there are there are eight stories to eat every night. She was in there. That one's that was double Dutch. She comes up often. She's she she comes up with ponytail. She sometimes she has a little puffs, but always double mouth. Always kind of like a twin, like twins. Mm -hmm. So they're my twins. Mm -hmm. So there's the, you know, different scenes, um, different situations. And like, do you like the inspiration of these come from like real life stuff, or yeah, how do you? Yeah, my memory, my history, mm -hmm. uh, hairdos from my past or my friends. Mm -hmm. um, definitely, those are the things. That so I they're do. more of like a reflection of like what you've been through, what yes. you've seen, definitely. and all that stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, definitely. And a struggle with the rich. Okay, so this is Anna Cohn, and these are her work where she basically explained that she's in the background right there, but she basically explained to us that she takes her views of women and she usually goes on like Craigslist and she basically does like calling on anyone that wants to, you know, be shoot. So she takes these women, as you can see here, she takes these women and she crops them out and then she also takes pictures of campuses at certain museums and also just finds them. She also is extremely, 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 I can't even, because you can see my favorite piece in the background. She loves diversity and she loves having a huge variety of women to take photos of. So she has young women, older women, she has women of color, different ethnicities and all that stuff. 
it's amazing. The work is so seamless. It's so like, I need to learn this skill. Like, look at this. These are actual paintings that you guys would see at a museum. And she added her own twist. Okay, so right now, there's so many questions raised, but there's so many questions, but there's a room of hair. Um, and I see she has hair back here, and each baggie has like names like this one right here has lisa this one is cotton clearly this is data which is like i'm guessing it's dreadlocks but like there are also locks here i can tell like this is uh <laughs> she has a blender as well so i'm guessing like she Blanza? I don't know, but this is. I'm like. Oh, look at the Harper's Bazaar. I'm intrigued, That's but. That's fucking dope, though. It's kind of freaky. How she has this in here? Stop. It is. That's really cool. Because that's like playing on the fact that, you know, like, white people are always trying to, like, jock our shit. <laughs> she blends this. stuff up and everything in here. Baby, I want to see, like,. I wanna. She dies in sub two. I just want to know. I'm guessing this is real. Yes. Due to the fact of upstairs. that table. Upstairs, so but. Well, we have her name. They have names on them. So. What if I give her my hair? And she dies them. Like, I, I wanna know what. But we have her. She's all about but i feel like this has to come with like clearly she is black she yeah. has dreadlocks so this has to come from some type of, you know cultural thing just inspiration i feel like she has like family members as well like i feel like this has to be like an grandmother and grandfather yeah like this yeah so or ancestors. I just want to know, and this looks and like a grandmother. Money. Yeah, so I don't know. Like, I want to know, like, the inspiration and concept. She also has sage. So, yeah. right here. So, yeah, this is cool. Yeah, this is like hella indigenous, hella, like, black. I'm hella feeling it. Pan Africanism, like, all the way. Mm hmm. Like, she got braids? Look at the braids. These are, look at those braids. I mean, this is supposed to be the African costume. Right, you think she would want one? That's a, you think she would take one? I'm kidding, I can't. Look, look. Remember what you were saying? Yeah, like she had like, mm -hmm. I don't know what these are, but. No, it has people's names on it. Yeah, but that's, those are dad. the baggies. Like she has a data no, right there. Dad. You were saying about family. Mm-hmm. And then, that. Okay. She has a whole bag right there. Well, I will definitely look her up and see, see what she's all about. I'll update you guys later. Give them hell, give them pressure. Big couch, no manners.